What's up, Tarnish? It's your ball. Be back with another video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the clans, the best clans. And we're going to do the tier list for them right here, right now. We're going to talk about the perks and everything as we go on. And, you know, what's trash and what's decent, you know, obviously. Uh, a lot of people have been requesting the tier list. And this is the official tier list. And what I think, and I'm assuming a lot of people would think, because it would make a lot of sense that you go for these clans. I don't know why my hair looks like it's a little... Do a little quick fix around here. Perks of being black, man. Um, yeah, get straight into it. Uh, first, uh, but now, uh, commons they get n n no traits, they get no perks at all, zero perks. Commons get zero perks. Um, so you know, so I knocked that out the way automatically. Um, we're gonna start with the rares. So the rares should be coming from here to dare. So the first rare is gonna be Miwa. Miwa, which is the girl's ability. So you get fifteen percent more um fifteen percent damage with weapons and you get a ten percent extra speed. You get ten percent extra speed and you know. So for Miwa, I I would go it's not bad because weapons are actually pretty pretty broken. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go right here for Miwa. Yeah, weapons are actually pretty broken. I'm not gonna lie. Don't if y'all saw my last video. Weapons do a lot of damage, bro. Um, Hoshi, 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 Hoshi. So Miwa, Hoshi. So Hoshi should be this one. Hoshi. The perks that you get for having Hoshi is eight percent more damage where curses. And you get 200 extra curse energy. I don't know if y'all knew that, but Hoshi's actually pretty damn good. You get a whole extra, two, like 200 extra curse energy. So Hoshi, I'm not gonna lie, you sitting up there with the the eight here. I didn't even know it gave that much. Jesus Christ! And that's a rare, bro. For a rare is actually that's actually pretty good. It's as much as Gojo, if anything. You know, I know whatever his name is. Um, you get 20% um, durability. For 1.5 seconds using a curse. After using a curse. Uh, sounds really mid. I'm not going to lie. You know, it sounds, it sounds really mid. Uh, sounds bad, but you do get a perk, so better than nothing. Nanami. Um, Nanami, you get 250 stamina. This is this is a rare? 100 um, HP. You get 35% curse, melee, and weapon damage. This is this Nanami? Jesus Christ. Nanami sitting up. Nanami's in front of this. Whoa. Active from 6, uh, 6 a.m. And game time. Okay. That's that's really that's really something else. Okay, Kujasaki. You get 200% cursed energy and 150 stamina, which is not bad at all. Let me see where Kujasaki is sitting at. Sitting at right here. Sitting at right here. What? Yeah, sitting at right here. So, I don't, I don't know. Honestly, yeah, it's not. Not enemies in front of it. I'm not gonna count. No, I'm not gonna count. Bro, think about it, bro. You only get into stamina and you get into curse, right? Nanami gives you the same amount. You get you get the curse, melee, and weapon damage, right? Plus you get the HP. Plus you get the 250 stamina. She only gets um like bro, like like literally you make up that 30% from your weapon and stuff. And everybody uses weapons to like do combo extenders. So if you think about it, Nanami is sitting over Kujasaki, and you know she's a legendary, obviously. And then we got the uh, Como. Como clan gives. 20% damage, um, must activate, um, 40 speed, Jesus Christ, where is that, oh, this is actually pretty good, active Como clan drains 10% of your HP, oh, hell no, alright, with this clan, this clan is good, but also, like, it has a downfall, like, when you're, it drains your blood, but it also gives you a 20% damage boost, so like this is a very like risky clan. I don't know if you know for the people that want to use it. And then last but not least, we got the two strongest clans, which is the Gojo clan and the Zenin clan. A lot of people already know what the Gojo clan gives. Um, but the Zenin clan, you get like more soul skills. 
you get dashing skills, you know, other abilities like that. Movement skills, really. So, you know, the Zen Clan is actually going to be in the bottom. It's going to be in the bottom. And then, because Gojo Clan gives you... Um, Gojo Clan gets a lot, bro. I'm not going to lie. Like, a crazy... Like, just, just a crazy amount of, like, buffs. Like, it's a little bit ridiculous how much buffs Gojo Clan actually gives. Damn, I can't even find it. But I know you get Limitless. You get more Curse Technique. You get more Defense. You get the eyes. You know? And Limitless alone already puts Gojo's Technique um, right above... <laughs> right above um, blood stick blah 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 blood can't even speak bro blood technique golly golly bugging but yeah yo let me know what y'all think about this tier list if I was fair I feel like I was super fair bro like Nanami is a little bit broken I honestly think Nanami should be up there with with this like I think it should be sitting like last on this tier list cause I ain't gonna lie to you fake you know shit on this one right here but hey it is what it is you know, the stamina and stuff is good, but, you know, Nanami beats it by, like, a whole whopping 100 extra stamina, you know? Especially if you're using, um, Nanami's gonna be really good, especially if you're using Toji, because you Toji uses up a lot of stamina whenever you use his ability. So that will be great. Gojo, Limitless alone, puts it above everything, because you literally cannot get damage from anything at all. You know, let me know what y'all think in the comments down below. How would y'all have done this tier list? Have y'all, would y'all have changed anything? Yes, be nice, bro. You know, this is my opinion. I said opinion. <clears throat> this is my opinion at the end of the day. Y'all can have your own opinions, but this is how I see it from my eyes. From if I was to use these ability, well, these clans to how I play in the game, you know, versus how you play in the game. And if you want to use, you know, by inf this information to choose a clan, like there's a anonymy is not a bad clan to use you know if you don't have enough spins i'm not gonna lie it's really good but yeah i'm gonna be catching you on the next video make sure i leave a like comment you know obviously subscribe and if you want to join my um discord link down below if you would if you're new to this game it is a kaizen game that you can obviously join the link will be down below the discord also will be down below if you join the discord you'll find information like sneak peeks updates and more information about the game and if you're curious to watching videos about you know for the game that can also hop to my channel y'all see a list of videos you know a, a little bit of popular videos down there y'all probably see my face already and y'all seeing my face again for this tier list that was never done and i will be coming out with the gojo the gojo um build and the i forgot what the next video is about but i have it in my book so Somebody else had requested, but somebody requested this. It made a lot of sense to me, so I did it. So, you know, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Catch you on the next one. We're on a road to 5,000 subscribers, and we're growing fast, guys. We're growing super fast, and I appreciate y'all. I cannot tell y'all how much I appreciate y'all. Really, let's get to that 5K and, you know, get ready for, you know, to bigger things, you know, bigger things. All right? Peace.